from Grand Global Hotel. Stop dreaming, realize your dream at Grand Global Hotel. We offer a variety of luxurious rooms and apartments at very affordable prices. Very affordable conference facilities of 10 to 300 people. Beautiful gardens, popular for parties and weddings. Outside catering services, very attractive wedding hosting plan. Wireless internet, automatic standby generator, excellent security and parking for over 120 cars and luxurious cars for airport pickup and touring. You do not have to spend a fortune on hotel services. Choose the Grand Globe Hotel and experience the five-star hotel luxuries at the lowest price in the city as you benefit from our flexible pricing plan. We fit in your budget. Save up to 60% on workshops, accommodation and wedding parties. We are conveniently located below Makere University, 200 meters off Sir Apolukagua Road at Ejin Petro Station. For reservations call 0312-516-620 or 0782-243-466 or 0704-710-915. Email manager at grandglobalhotel.co.ug. This is unbelievable! Oh, it has been reduced to Pacatini! I'll buy myself too. I'll also buy for my neighbor. What price has been reduced? The Go TV decoder price. It has been reduced from 139,000 to 79,000 shillings only. <laughs> Chilo Chatara! For just 79,000 shillings, get a Go TV DVB T2 digital decoder. That meets the digital migration standards. An outdoor Go antenna and one month of Go TV Plus. Go TV, entertaining Africa. A product of multi choice. Datamine Technical Business School, an affiliate college of Makere University Business School, invites applications for the August-September intake. At Datamine, we award diplomas and certificates in business and technical courses like Information Technology and Systems Management, Computer Repair and Networking, Journalism and Media Studies, Telecom and Electrical Engineering, Motor Vehicle Engineering, Solar Production and Battery Repair, Business Administration, Accounting and Finance, Fashion and Design, among others, plus a variety of short and professional courses. Come and experience skills training at its best. We are located at Bativa Recrescent, off Bombo Road, next to Bativa Hotel. For details, call the numbers on the screen. Sanyu FM, today's best music. I hope that even a soccer lover this time will not have an excuse. If you have a pay TV, you will see it through the pay TV. If you don't have a pay TV, you have free viewing TV, you will see it without paying any penny. And we are looking for partnership with sponsors where we could make make it better. Okay. Issues at hand, WBS TV, Peter Chivazo, your host. We are talking resettlement, we are talking development or redevelopment as it were. Uh, this show is proudly brought to you, courtesy of uh, Grand Global Hotel at Makere Sapolo Kagwa Road. They say go and join them, go and enjoy their services at a cost you can afford. Um, viewers, you are able to join this show, put through your 
call we are going to display our numbers on the set very shortly uh, those should be displayed and you can also send your SMS on 8090 you send your SMS on 8090 we are able to read that we are able to uh, interact with you uh, put your questions and comments to the gentleman and lady in the studio David I come back to you yes. the cost uh, it has been said I know that uh, the people that uh, were moved out of Naguru Nakawa we are told you will be able to own, to own. Okay. when the price is named none of them come mm -hmm. ultimately so it is effectively being thrown off we've taken people out of markets mm -hmm. and said when the market is finally constructed you will be able to own the store when the price of the store is said mm -hmm. you would sell tomatoes for a lifetime you would never own the store okay. so isn't this very much deja vu uh, I, do, I wouldn't agree that it's deja vu and this is why number one as a if we the, the whole reason that we would uh, approach this from a public private partnership between the national housing the private entity the minister of uh, lands housing and urban development who to, to uh, which sector national housing falls under and the and, it, and the financial that will be coming on board to provide the uh, uh, money for mortgages at a, a discretionary rate we think it's one of the ways that we are looking at uh, making this house affordable but indeed we plan this estate to be this housing project to be a kind of a mixed project that will cater to the needs of work, uh, of all the people across the spectrum the first priority because of course being the residents we know that even right now on ground that respect from the representative in as much as uh, from the people who are, they are on the rentals people who don't own the homes they are living in to those who have actually built uh, or like bit explained uh, some decent houses like your pictures have shown but uh, in the, in making this house che cheaper and affordable a number of things are being done one will design a house that uh, will address the information that will have gathered from the people on the ground what are the minimum requirements they they need and then at the at the point of execution we we are we are projecting that the government will come in to provide some of the infrastructure costs we are aware that infrastructure alone provision of electricity water and the, the other services if you contribute about 35 percent of the cost of the house so if the government has already partnered with us to reduce to go to provide that those services through either either the its own entities uh, the national waters the umemes or through the local authorities in this case either wakiso district or Kira town council we see that the price will go down D david uh, l let me come to the real figures yes. here mm. because uh, that's the grand picture mm. let's work with the figures okay a man is seated on possibly three or four decimals of land exactly they fit in a house Mm. and the family lives there mm. you with tin for their roof mud and water for the wall yes. that is on the uh, lowest end okay. I haven't seen any grass touch there uh, on the higher end you may have someone seated on 15 decimals with a tiled roof mm. the, that is not quite a lot of my concern I'm concerned about the middle line between the people seated on three decimals to all the way to the 15 how much is the cost unit that one makes you as national housing break even because you're not in charity yes I suppose sure. mm. uh, national housing as a business is not doing charity no. therefore you're going to build houses whether they are going